When you hear the word sheriff, maybe you think of old westerns. But sheriffs exist today. In Massachusetts, they hold lots of power within the criminal legal system. Did you know that sheriffs have custody of over 6,000 people every day? That's over half of the state's incarcerated population. And did you know that the sheriff serves a six-year term, the longest term a state official can serve? If you don't, you're not alone. In a recent poll, 83% of Massachusetts voters could not even correctly name their sheriff. And in the last election, about half a million voters went to the polls but did not vote for a candidate for sheriff. It's time for that to change. It's time to get to know your sheriff. Sheriffs oversee county jails and houses of correction. Sheriffs control conditions inside jails, such as medical care, access to phone calls and visitors, and whether people in their custody have access to addiction and mental health treatment. Sheriffs decide what education and rehabilitation programs to offer so that those re-entering their communities are prepared to do in a positive way. In other words, sheriffs have tremendous power. And when voters don't know their sheriff, that power can go unchecked. Recent polling showed that a majority of Massachusetts voters don't know what their sheriffs do, how long they serve, or even that they are elected and not appointed officials. But here's the upside. Polling also showed that when Massachusetts voters learn more about the role and responsibilities of county sheriffs, they are far more likely to vote in a sheriff's election and vote for candidates who reflect their values that's why today, the ACLU of Massachusetts and our partners around the Commonwealth are launching the Know Your Sheriff campaign. In 2022, no matter where you live in Massachusetts, you will get to vote for your sheriff. So, it's time to know your sheriff. It's time to know. Your sheriff can decide who gets opioid treatment or doesn't. It's time to know your sheriff can respect due process and the rule of law or trample on the rights of people in their care and custody. It's time to know your sheriff answers to you and your community, not hate groups. We need to prioritize transformation and healing over punishment and retribution. And we need your help to get information to voters because voters have the power to move sheriffs to make our communities better, safer, and more just for all.